All right, guys, new intro here for the Bear Pack. Let's take a look at our subscription goal. We are sitting at almost 9,300. We need 700 more subs to hit that 10K goal to give that $1,000 giveaway. And then we have 12K subs coming up to send a couple people to some games of their choice. Trey, let's take a look at that leaderboard. Dennis Burns is at the top. We have Kellen on this week. He's doing a great job so far, but that is the leaderboard right now. If you see if you see your guys' name, reach out to us. Bears Profit plays at gmail.com or on Twitter, Bears Profit at Bears Profit. And we need to get you guys set up. So we can give you guys your picks out for the next couple of weeks. If you see your name, make sure you reach out. Also, if you want to become a member on our YouTube channel, we're going to be giving away $50 weekly to our members on YouTube. We have 15 to 20 right now. So if you become a member for just $4.99 a month, you have a chance to win $50 weekly. We're going to be doing that on our live show. We're going to put everybody on the wheel. We're going to spin it and give away $50 a week. So make sure you guys come check that out. Only $4.99 a month. Very cheap over there. And our plays are actually better over there as well. So Guys, is going to do it. Let's get into the video. All right, guys, let's get some NBA picks and props for Monday, December 25th, slated games. Merry Christmas, everybody. Trey and I coming to you at 7.50 in the morning on, on Christmas Day. Hopefully, everybody has a great Christmas. Trey, let's take a look at that leaderboard. Let's start us off. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. I gave out the bucks on the money line on the last game. We didn't have any games on Sunday, so this was from Saturday. Bucks on the money line versus the Knicks. They absolutely beat their ass. Yeah, Trey, 0-1 uh, for me. I don't even remember what I gave out. You want to help me? Um, I don't know. It definitely wasn't fading the Lakers because that would have been a win for you. 0-1. Let's go over to the plays for today. Trey, start us off. Yeah, guys, I went with the Milwaukee Bucks versus New York Knicks again. Deja vu in uh, it's minus three for the Bucks. Not enough. Give me the Bucks here at minus three. They're the better team. They just got done beating the Knicks Bucks by 19 points. And if we look at their last 10 matchups, the Bucks, they've actually won nine straight against the Knicks. They have dominated in this matchup. Tom Thibodeau. Simply cannot stop Giannis and just add in Damian Lillard there. And it's just causing him even more havoc because these two teams, they've already played three times this season. First game, Bucks won by five. Second game, Bucks won by 22. And just a few days ago, Bucks won by 19. None of these games have been relatively close. It's just been the Jalen Brunson show for the Knicks. And there's only so much Brunson can do going up against Giannis and Damian Lillard. It's going to be same old, same old with this matchup. I don't care. It's Christmas Day in New York, but the building's going to be buzzing at Madison Square Garden. Giannis and Dame, they're going to want to show up and show out. So give me the Bucks here at minus three versus the Knicks. Yeah, Christmas Day basketball is always the best. We got these big matchups. I'm going to be looking at the Celtics going on the road to take on the Lakers. The Celtics have been an absolute wagon over the last eight games. I was down on them early. Uh, they've won four of the last five. They really should have won five of the last five. They lost in overtime to the Golden State Warriors, had a massive comeback by the Warriors. In this game, though, I'm going to take the Lakers, Trey. I'm going to take them plus three and a half. I know you're happy about it. Um it really boils down to the Lakers don't care in the regular season playing teams. They get up, though, for big games. And this is the biggest game of the regular season. It's Christmas Day. LeBron James and Anthony Davis have their normal questionable tag, but they're both going to play in this game. Uh, this means a lot to players. So I like LeBron James on Christmas Day. He was complaining about the jerseys yesterday. Shocker, LeBron James is complaining. But I'm going to take the Lakers at home. I think the Celtics are going to come in. They're going to think they're hot shit, and the Lakers are going to shut them down. I think this game is going to be low scoring as well, so if you'd like the under, I'd take it. Uh, but I'm going to take the Lakers plus three and a half as the official play. Trey, let's go over to the player props. Have you start us off? Yeah, guys, I went 0-1 on Saturday. Very upset about it. I give it uh, out. Giannis onto the Kumpo. Over 17 and a half RAs versus the Knicks. It was very frustrating. He really didn't do overly much there. Uh, he, I think he was probably about six away from hitting, so it was frustrating for me. Yeah, I had Lillard over his points in the same game. He did not hit, and I do want to mention, um, looking at it right now, I had the Clippers. Uh, plus four and a half, they got absolutely trounced by the Boston Celtics, 145-108 to 108 for my game pick. So, 0-1-1 player prop for me. Trey, let's take a look at the player props for today. Starts off. Yeah, guys, I'm going to be attacking Kristaps Porzingis here. Over 24 and a half PRs versus the Lakers. This is just far too low for what Porzingis has been doing this season and for just essentially what he does against Anthony Davis as well. Because if we look at what Kristaps is doing this season – Averaging 19.2 points, 6.9 rebounds per game, which is right at this number, barely over it. And I'm just confused of why it's so low, because like I said, he dominates Anthony Davis. Over his last two games versus AD, Porzingis, he's averaging 25 points per game, which is already over this number, and also 10 and a half rebounds per game. This guy loves to put on a show, loves to not bang with the bigs with Anthony Davis, because they kind of play similar games. I think that's why Porzingis kind of plays good against him. He doesn't have to worry about someone banging with 280 pounds against them like Joel Embiid or something like that. But I love Kristaps Porzingis in this game. It's a road game for him on Christmas. He's going to want to show up in Los Angeles. So give me Kristaps Porzingis to show up and show out. I'm taking him over 24 and a half PRs versus the Lakers. 
I like it, Trey. I'm going to go with Jalen Brunson over 27 points in your game. You said it. Jalen Brunson's a monster this season. He's averaging 25 or 26.5 points per game. In the last game against the Bucks, he put up 36 points. He was really the only guy trying to do anything out there. Uh, I don't know if you guys have been watching the tape, but Julius Randle, he needs to be cut. Like, I know he's getting paid millions and millions and millions of dollars, but that dude just doesn't try. It's crazy to watch uh, day in and day out. He gives lack of effort. Jalen Brunson is a guy. He puts his head down. He goes to work. He's a gritty player. I think he scores way over 27 points, 30-plus points in this game against the Bucks. Last game, he shot 26 times. He's averaging nearly 20 shots per game this season. He's going to have to have a big game to keep up with the Bucs. Like Trey said, I think the Bucs take this one. But Jalen Brunson puts up a fight over 27 points as my play today. Guys, let's get to the graphic, and we'll get out of here. Yeah, I went with the Bucs again. I'm taking a minus 3.5 in this game versus the Knicks. I love this play for him. I think they were minus 2.5 last time versus the Knicks. So just barely getting the bump here, but I love it. I'm also going with Christoph Porzingis over 24.5 PRs versus the Lakers. Set too low. He averages 25 points against AD over his last two. So I love that we're getting this low PR number for him. That's a crazy. He's averaging 25 against AD. That's crazy. Uh, I'm going to take the Lakers plus three and a half. I'm going to take Trey's team. I'm going to trust him one more time. I do think it's going to be a low scoring game. So that's going to favor Lakers here. And they give me Jalen Brunson over his total points, 27 going up against the Celts. Uh, he's the best player on the team right now. He's shooting the ball, shooting the lights out of the ball. So I love him there. Guys, Merry Christmas. That's going to do it for NBA Plays and Props for Monday, December 25th, Lady Games. If you guys enjoyed the content, please sure drop a like on this video and subscribe to the channel below. See you guys next video. And thanks for watching. We had multiple questions this morning about how to become a member for the YouTube channel. Let's do that really quick tutorial. You're going to go to youtube.com. You're going to go to Bears Profit Plays. You're going to search it in. You're going to hit our thing. There's a join button right just to the right of the subscribe. You're going to click that. There's two options. You have the Bear Pack for $4.99. That gives you access to YouTube member plays. And then you have the Bear Pack Gold for $7.99 a month. That gives you access to our member plays on YouTube. And it gives you a one-month membership to our website, bearsprofitplays.com. So if you get the Bear Pack Gold, you save yourself 2 bucks a month. A little bit cheaper if you want to do that. But that is the tutorial for anybody that needed it. We had multiple questions today through email about how to do it, and it wasn't working. But if you want to know, there it is right there. Trey, 